Yo, how's it going ladies and gentlemen? I hope it's going good. I'm bringing you all a really good gameplay here. 150 kill specialist. Yes, you heard it correct. It's not a world record, but it is my record for the most amount of kills I've ever achieved. 150 kill specialist, triple moab. Uh, I go on specialist of quite a few more times um, throughout the gameplay. I show a few of them, a couple of them. So it could have been a quad moab, but I didn't play smart enough. I was rushing like crazy, you know, going balls deep into the spawns. I'm not going to talk too much about the gameplay, although although I do want to address some of the comments I've been receiving on my latest video about the support and stuff and people saying I force my subscribers to my viewers to run support. For one, guys, I'll leave a video response below uh, telling you all, explaining you all in depth, in depth, in depth. That's such a weird word. Um, you know what support actually is and why people do it and so on and so forth but for one I can never force somebody to do anything over the internet it's literally almost impossible how could I force somebody it's not like I'm going to their house saying I'm going to murder their family if they don't do something for me it's the internet you know they can choose what they want to do and they do and the majority of the time people offer to run support and in this gameplay not every single person was running support or you would see 5,000 ballistic vests but a few people did offer to run support and I invited them and they, you know, ran support. And you know, I just really wanted to address that. You people care so much for no reason and not only are you, you know, um, bashing on me, you're hating on me, you're hating on the people who, you know, I play with because they don't do anything wrong, but you're making it seem as if they do something wrong. They just wanna play with me and that's what they do, and I'm not mean to my subscribers or viewers in any way you can ask them all. Although, you know, if you're a stupid subscriber or a stupid viewer, I'll tell you straight up. But if you're one of the people that respects me and respects the stuff I post on my channel and anything else I may do, then I respect you back. So that's just the way it is. But the gameplay is not going to be the main topic of this commentary. Although I am using my usual MP7 try hard, try hard panty setup class. Now, silencer and extended mags. And. My starting perks are sleight of hand, hard line, and sit rep, and my specialist perks are stalker, quick draw, and steady aim. But what I want to talk about is going to be the second installment. No, it's going to be episode one, part two of a, my in real life stories. And this is going to be the last time I saw my first girlfriend. I told you all my first girlfriend. I'll leave it as a video response below. Um, it was a commentary about my first girlfriend, and this is going to be the part two of that the last time I ever saw my girlfriend so obviously you all wanted to hear about her yeah you wanted to hear about the second part that's why I'm doing this um, yeah, well this is a story about the last time I saw her it was a few years ago and me and, a, and me and a few buds heard about a random party that we were not invited to but we decided to go anyway and it was a really huge party there was a lot of people outside and it was a rich kids house a real rich kid and uh, People were drunk, people were doing drugs, they were doing all kinds of stuff. There was a lot of nudity involved, I guess you could say. And this is the true story, man. I would never make up something like this, completely true. And it was something like you would see in the Project X, you know, the movie, but not as intense. But it was it was a pretty cool party and it was uh, not what we were expecting, to say the least. Anyway. We go in minding our own business to an extent. We were always looking for anything that caught our eyes, though. And as soon as I walked in, I took my shoes off because the rich kid insisted, uh, insisted, you know, not to wear my shoes inside the house. He didn't want me to track mud in or anything, dirt, grass, whatever it may be. Um, I saw her. I noticed her. And after many years, we were reunited. But she didn't notice me right off the bat. So I continued on throughout my night, you know talking to people doing my thing I wasn't a drinker but I was doing other stuff and eventually she noticed me and when she was drunk she was wasted and as soon as she noticed me she was all over me and when I say all over me I mean like bird shit on a car window like all over me you know and I didn't want to take advantage of her I don't take advantage of women under the influence of any type of substance I just don't feel right you know I don't I want to it's an achievement like this gameplay I want to achieve it you know without some I don't even know how to say it like I just don't want to I don't want to take advantage of a woman you know 
there's no point to do it I mean if you do that you can do whatever you want to you know you can do it's up to you man you can do whatever you want to do but that's just not my thing and uh, so I didn't do anything with her we just talked for a little bit and then she went on with her night and started later that night I saw her with another guy I mean right out in the open too they these people were being blatant I remember there was a chick passed out in the bathroom and there was just people making out and you know getting getting jiggy with it right there in front of you like there was no <laughs> it was no discrepancy it was just right in front of your face you could see it it was like a in real life porn video and this is no and this is rated mature <laughs> Call of Duty's rated 17 plus for a reason, guys. That's because the commentaries over the Call of Duty gameplay may be rated 17 plus as well. But hopefully, you all enjoyed this. And that was the last time I saw my first girlfriend. Haven't seen her since, and I don't think I will. And I don't want to either. But hopefully, you all enjoyed the gameplay and the commentary. I'll be doing more in real life stories, but that's the last you'll hear of my first girlfriend. But yeah, guys, uh, hope you all enjoyed. I'm just going to let the gameplay finish itself. Oh, yeah, and by the way, we lose the gameplay. Yeah, we lose this game. I know. It sucks. But peace the fuck out, YouTube.